You've done well for yourself. Sadly, I don't have anything for you. I only work with the less experienced guild members. You should go see Scriva in Breville from now on. You can find her at the Lonely Suitor Lodge. I wouldn't recommend bothering her at home, unless the door is unlocked. Ah, you are the new thief. I am your new doyen. I have a special request from the widow of a former fence in Leowin. As your new doyen, I am asking you to help her. A street scavenger made off with a ring that the widow Adarji values highly. She is offering a reward. The guild frowns on freelance thieves... Are you willing to go to Leowin, find the ring, and get it back to Adarji? This is good. Go to Leowin, speak with Adarji, and help her find her ring. Good hunting. I'm only asking for enough to feed me kids. I know of her. Uh, what's it worth to you? She lives on the west side of town. She is fond of the Three Sisters Lodge in the evening, but takes her midday meal at the Five Claws. We're all talking about the Emperor's... She lives on the... Blessings of Stemdar upon me. It looks... Why does the prey approach me? Yes. A filthy Argonian stole my precious ring. It was a gift from my mate. It has sentimental value. I will pay well. The stupid lizard hunts with the name Amusai. Find him, find my ring. Make him suffer, kill him, and I will be pleased. Stupid guild rules. He is only an Argonian. He is less than human and much less than Khajiit. If you must spare him, at least make him suffer. I'm willing to teach if you're willing to. Swift hunting. I can eat for a day with a single coin. I might know that for a price. Huh. The poor bugger was arrested. Seems he tried to swindle the Countess. He's rotting in a cell in the castle dungeon now. It's common knowledge that the jailers can be bribed to allow visitors to see prisoners. Blessings of Akatosh, Bunny. You 
got some nimble fingers. What have you been getting into? You're not supposed to be down here. Yeah, we got him here. Argonians aren't allowed visitors, though. Countess Alicia's orders. She's the thing about the lizard folk. Amu say, you say? <laughs> I thought you wanted to, to see Amu Day. He's off limits. Amu say, though, is just down the hall. Uh, make it quick. I have to get back to work now. Ah, the Thieves' Guild's new favorite. What do you want? Why should I tell you where it is? Here I sit in Leowin's dungeon while you are free. What will you do for Amusai if I tell you? You do that for me? Maybe you guild types aren't so bad after all. Okay, it's a deal. Give me a lockpick and I'll tell you about the ring. Sunlit freedom. Yes, I stole that ring from Adaji. When I went to sell it, the fence told me I was too hot for him. He showed me an inscription on the inside. To Alessia. That had to be the Countess of Leowin. The damn ring was stolen property. Well, I figured I would ransom it back to the Countess. Except she tricked me. I was arrested for theft. And she kept the ring. Uh, the Countess rarely leaves the castle. Good luck getting it back. I owe you a debt of gratitude. Have pity on an old war veteran. Please be generous. So, Alicia Caro has recovered her ring, and now you want to know where she keeps it so you can steal it back. My pockets are a little light at the moment, if you know what I mean. I don't know where she keeps the ring, but I know who does. Talk to Ladara Mothro, the Countess's handmaiden. She eats dinner in the castle at the Eighth Bell. You may have to sweet-talk her, but she knows all about Alicia Caro's habits and schedules. You should know that there are other secrets in that castle. I've heard of a hidden torture chamber. They say that Count Marius interrogates Argonian immigrants from Black Marsh. The servants whisper that the Argonians are dragged into the basement and never seen again. You should stay out of there, just in case. Blessings of the Shadow upon you. You're in good spirits today, my lady. I am Lodora Mothril, Lady Leowen's chaplain and chief advisor. I assist her ladyship so that her enlightened policies might achieve the greatest possible influence upon the affairs of County Leowen. 
Lady Alessia frowns on her staff, talking about her personal life. You understand, I'm sure. What? Countess Carol is so relieved to have the ring back. It's been missing for many years. She wears it constantly. Well, not all the time. I mean, she puts it in her jewelry box for baths and at night. No proper lady would wear her jewelry to bed. Morning, she's at the town chapel. At the castle, she hosts the evening meal at eight. She retires sometime after eleven. She travels to Coral on the Ides of every month. Don't even try to find her between the fifteenth and seventeenth. Shh! It's dangerous to be heard talking about that. The Countess has a secret passage somewhere in the basement that leads to her private quarters. That's where the torture chamber is. Sometimes I can hear the screams of the prisoners when I'm in my chambers. I think I hear Milady calling.
I'm listening. Yes. Why does the prey approach me? Does the hunter have this one's ring? My ring, all oh, thanks to the claws of the clan mother, you have recovered it. Is that slimy Argonian dead? Did he suffer long? I hope so. You have earned the reward. The thieves' guild was always good to Adaji's dearest mate. I am grateful that the memory is still honored. Swift hunting. You have returned? Good work. You are truly an asset to the guild. I will make sure the Grey Fox himself hears about this. I am promoting you to Prowler. Congratulations. Shadow hide the hunter. <laughs> 